I mean, how you living, bro? Oh, man, another day at it, man. I can't complain. 3 SPM. Yeah, yeah. Man, well, today, you know, we uh talking about the Oregon-Colorado game. Uh, how's everyone? Can we close that, please? We got stats. As far as going into this game, um, I wasn't shocked or surprised. Just to be honest, my score prediction on the game was 48 to 18. And that 18 depended on if Colorado could put up 18. During practice, you know, they was uh, trying to prep Colorado for this game by, like, you know, pulling out the big speakers on the field, you know, and they was blasting loud music, you know, just trying to simulate what the stadium was going to be like, you know what I mean? Given that, you know, Oregon is, you know, such a uh, – has such a rowdy fan base, you know, they're known for for their fans, you know, and, 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 and for winning, you know what I mean? Uh, pre-game, the coach uh, he had a little a little pep talk. Rooted in substance, not flash. Rooted in substance. Today we talk with our pads. You talk with your helmet, right? Every moment. The Cinderella story is over, man. Right? They're fighting for clicks. We're fighting for wins. There's a difference, right? There's a difference, right? This game ain't gonna be played in Hollywood. It's gonna be played on the grass. I, I thought that that speech, you know. Uh, probably resonated very, very well with his team before they went and stepped out on the field before that first kickoff, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, man, uh, I w what shocked me about the game, for real, for real, was uh, seven sacks, bro. Like, you know, like, they was eating them up back there in the pocket. Shador backing up again, taken down again. Third and six, four-man rush. Shador spins out of it. Another man in his face and sacked again. That's the fourth time. Who doesn't get him to him quickly? Watch out. Third and six. He got run over. From the outside, from the inside, Evan Williams again. He was a great defensive value, you know what I mean, for, uh, for Oregon for the most part. Uh, Colorado did get hit with a lot of penalties, man. Like, that was my thing. I think what I got from it, was it was a lot of mental mental mistakes and then they were just out coached like um like Deion Sanders was saying um post game in the post game press conference it's a good old fashioned buck kicking it's no excuses no nothing um their coaches did a heck of a job preparing their team obviously we didn't um we lost offensively defensively as well as special teams that fake punt and they are going to fake it. And it is going to work out. Would you look at this? That was from their own 17 yard line as they fake it with Casey. Kind of kind of got them really rolling and uh, they didn't stop. You know, that's all they could do, you know, is really review the tape and revise, you know, and, um, you know, come back better, you know, and stronger. Yeah, I mean, you're going to do that every week, though. That's not, you know what I'm saying? That's something, that's that's the obvious. You know what I'm saying? Like, Oh, yeah, it, it, it's not like the season's over. They both got monsters to look forward to playing. You know, I get a little passionate at times, right? I get a little excited about what I want to accomplish for, for our team, and I just want to say, you know, I need to humble myself a little bit. This is one game. You know what I'm saying? Like, they act like they're playing against him, you know? Their competition's with him. You know what I mean? And he's like, he already has his acclimates. He's already, he's already, he already is who he is. You you put added pressure on these kids, you know what I'm saying? And on your team, if you want to be honest, you know what I mean? You put added pressure by all your antics, you know what I mean? And all, all you know what I'm saying? All the, all the talk, instead of just showing it on the field. Like this was a conference game. They, they're they all one in the conference. And when you look at the conference that they're in, I'm trying to see who they, who are they going to beat in that conference. USC is tough. Utah's tough. Washington's tough. Washington State's tough. Oregon State's tough. Well, salute to Oregon and Colorado Buffaloes. 3SPN and we out.